Hello everybody, this is Damien Ovid, your city manager, and I have another update for you all um, as we head into the holidays. So um, just real quick, on January 5th, we have a, a blood drive, a community blood drive going on, um, and we're partnering with um, uh, the Runner Park Department of Public Safety, Rancho Adobe Fire, and also Sonoma State, uh, their police department. And the blood drive um, is gonna be over at the Doubletree Hotel from 1.30 to 6.30 p.m. Um, again, January 5th. And if you are interested in signing up for that, you can find the sign up on the, if you go to the sit, our City of Katati's webpage under City Hall and City News, you'll see the city manager's report for December 13th posted there with a link. Uh, but basically it's called the Bucket Brigade, which you may also be able to find just by Googling it. We also have some projects going on. Um, it's gonna be, they're gonna be continuing through the holidays. So uh, I just wanna let you know about that. The sewer main project on West Sierra Avenue is continuing, and um, I expect it to be largely complete by the end of the uh, end of December, but it could um, go into the first half of January. And that's replacing the sewer main on West Sierra Avenue. To uh, it's the old the sewer main there was really old and it was um, leaky, so um, let's quickly tighten it up and make sure we don't get um, a bunch of extra groundwater and rainwater into our sewers that that we don't we have to pump and pay for the treatment of. So that helps everybody out. Um, and then we're uh, doing the Katati Park project. So that large park that's behind the shopping center where Oliver's is, is, um, is an old park and um, it hasn't been upgraded in many, many years. So the city is completely refurbishing that, um, that park. So that means new playgrounds, um, adding picnic areas with gazebos, we're adding a restroom um, for the public that didn't exist, um, adding lighting for safety and um, I think, I, like I think I said, just landscaping throughout. So um, a major refurbishment of that. And then lastly, we are hosting um, uh, winter camps. So this week uh, before Christmas and then the week between Christmas and New Year's, and I believe the first day after New Year's, um, while school is out, but parents may still be working, uh, we, are, uh, we are holding a camp. So if you need um, somewhere for your children to, um, to hang out and have fun while you're at work, uh, come to the city webpage and look at the recreation part of the page and you can see the signups for the camps um, there. And with that, I just want to wish everyone a very, very happy, um, very happy holidays and a great new year for 2023. Thanks everyone. Bye.